<laughs> what is your... Milo. Oh, Milo. Milo, come up here. Come here. So Rachel, what's your top tip for performance on the grit stone? Um, watch as many videos as you can. Try and find some of the shorter people. Uh, bring lots of layers. Huh? Lots there. <laughs> lots of layers and yeah, trust your feet. All good tips. <laughs> Yeah. Top tip, Carlos, it's not um, be better. Yeah, definitely. Um, <laughs> I think it's uh, for some certain problems, it's worth trying to be dynamic, and then for some, you can be static. This example here, you need to hop up onto a palm down on the left hand, um, and not doing that makes the move a lot harder. So, yeah, definitely keep an eye out where you need to be more dynamic. <laughs> Big and size, like just time. time Wh whatever you want, like what's your top tip for climbing grips? Once you've got to a point where you are ready to start trying to climb from the beginning, being really conscious of timing your rest and figuring out how much you need to do. Didn't time your rest, did you, Tom? <laughs> <laughs> and what's your top tip? Um, my top tip would probably be to bring a brush stick, um, especially if you haven't got any tall friends. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> so, gritstone top tip is to brush the holds between every go and then wait a few minutes before going on it again to let any extra moisture go away. The wind can do your work for you. That's right, so Carlos. can Carlos. <laughs> What's your top tip? Top tip. <laughs> good energy, not the price. Good sight, good company. Feeding up each other. 